OneDrive is a Microsoft's cloud storage solution that you can use for free or with a subscription to Microsoft 365. But if you're currently experiencing this login error, such as like this in this picture, we will explain how to fix this problem in this video tutorial. Now there are several ways to fix this issue. The first one is to make sure that you have installed the latest OneDrive application updates. And you can check if your application has the latest updates by right-clicking on the blue or white cloud icon in your taskbar, and then select Settings. On the window, click on About tab, go to About Microsoft OneDrive, and then click the version link. After doing so, the application will launch a support page. Now the next thing you have to do is to compare your OneDrive version with the latest version listed on the support page. And then download OneDrive for Windows if it does not have the latest OneDrive version. Now the next method that you can try is to reset OneDrive cache by pressing the Windows key and the letter R to open the Run dialog box. Then, copy and paste this into the dialog window, and then press Enter or select OK. The third method that you can try is to check your internet connection and OneDrive server status. This is because the error can also occur when the connection to the server is timed out. And lastly, you can try repairing your Microsoft Office application. Now to do that, right-click on the Start menu, and then select Apps and Features. Then, scroll down, select the Microsoft Office installation package, and then click Modify. A Microsoft Office dialog box will open asking, How would you like to repair your Office program? along with two options, the Quick Repair and the Online Repair. Now you have to first select the Quick Repair. But if the issue still persists, select the Online Repair. Then, restart your computer to check the results. And those are the possible ways to fix the error code. And that's it for today's video. Please like, subscribe, and click the notification bell if you would like to see more tutorials like this.